going on guys this is Mino or you can call me Cam and yes I'm finally back to uploading as you guys can tell by uh, my recent edit you know the hardcore mini edit if you guys haven't seen that in the ah, I can't even talk in the description so yeah um it's been a while you guys know it's been seven months almost seven months since I haven't uploaded but uh you know I'm just gonna do a, a After Effects tutorial my uh, first tutorial ever got you know, almost 600 likes. It's the number one video on my channel. Um, only 16 likes. This video, I really didn't like it because the quality was bad. It was on my laptop and my voice. I don't know how my voice is right now. Hopefully it's clear. You guys can understand me. But um, yeah, this video is, I don't know, I should have done better. But this time I'm on my desktop as you guys can tell from the you know taskbar, from you know the difference and stuff. And yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, I want to tell you guys, go ahead, follow me on Twitter. I don't post a lot because I don't have a lot of followers. You know, if I get maybe a couple more followers, I will post a whole lot. And, uh, guys, I'll keep you updated. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get in into it. Uh, I Yes, I have attempted to do this uh, tutorial earlier, but, you know, the, you know, my other recording system did not work properly. But, guys, I will show you guys this. Hopefully, it does not lag. And yeah, all right, let's go. Never mind, it's, it's lagging, and probably it was loud on your, your, uh, you know, as you're watching it, it's probably loud. But I'm gonna be showing you guys this effect. I'm just gonna call it the warp shot. I I don't know what else to call it. I mean, the preset is called warp, but uh, I just call it warp shot. I haven't seen a tutorial on this. It's very simple. Um, not many people know how to do it. I guess I have no idea. But I needed, you know, a tutorial idea. By the way, guys, I'm kind of talking too much. I, need, I just need to get to the point. But, uh, you know, comment some tutorial ideas. I need some ideas and stuff. But I'm going to go ahead and get right into it. I'm not going to go right back into this project. So what I'm going to do, I might use the... Let's use the same um, clip as you can see right now. If you'll, you know, highlight. There you go. All right. So I'm just gonna trim it down some all the way back here. Um, so you gotta go to the point where you want the effect to start. Let's say as soon as the let's say yeah as soon as the 300 dies down, I want to go ahead and uh, actually cut this right here. So go where you want to start. I guess right here is a good spot. I'm not gonna twist it or it quickster it or anything so I guess go right here control Y it really doesn't matter where actually but um, go here actually that's too much I have too much things go to effect distort if I can find it and warp there you go it's that simple as you guys can see it looks a little funny yes but go ahead and set everything to zero and uh, Go ahead and go to the last shot, like as soon as he shoots. So right here, go to your clip, split it. I'm pretty sure you guys will already have everything synced up and everything. But uh, as soon as you do that, go here, right up to warp, go to arc, go to fish eye. And you don't see anything because, you know, like I said, change everything to zero. Now what you want to do is keyframe, press U, make sure you have your adjustment layers, you know, highlighted. Now what you want to do is go to the left 20 or 30 frames, it doesn't matter to your liking. So what you want to do is control shift arrow left, you know, one, two, three. So what I just did there, I just went over three, 30 frames. So what you want to do is control, no, not control, alt end bracket. I mean, beginning bracket. I'm kind of stuttering here and there because I'm trying to hurry up and not go over eight minutes because my other video was like six minutes but I kinda didn't describe everything well so uh, yeah as soon as you do that uh, you wanna come here and do ne actually not negative keyframe it go back to your second keyframe now you wanna go over like two to six frames but I'm going over four so control arrow left four times so one two three four this is kinda like off sync but you guys get the point uh, you wanna put negative 50 now you can see the clip you know zooming in and stuff now you want to go back to that other 
other keyframe because you don't want to have like negative 50 and then zero so you want to change this to negative 100 there you go now you have that effect now you want to go over one two three four four frames now you want to put negative 10 actually no negative 20 negative 20 should be fine and then you want to so you're done with that now you want to go over maybe 40 to 60 frames so I'll just go over 50 so which is control shift right five times so one two three four five okay now let the auto save I don't know why it's saving but okay I mean I am in the project now it's not responding okay um oh my god there we go okay there we go now you want to put this bet right back down to zero now what you want to do is uh, easy ease uh, the first I mean the last one in the middle one now what I'm just gonna ram preview it and I'm not gonna show the whole thing because you like I said it's gonna lag or you can see it right here in the ram preview um, so yeah I mean I'm not gonna go in detail of like the um, the effects you can use you can use whatever you want but at the starting point like at the shot you can add twitch blur whatever you want uh, glow exposure does not matter but um if you guys are up to this point let me know if you guys want me to go over this uh, you know this preset I made myself I called it white noise oh crap you can't see my presets <laughs> okay um, I put so much stuff in this uh, this one preset I clicked on it again okay I can't click on it I put so much stuff on this preset it looks really clean and nice you got this, um, this TV effect noise thingy looks really nice um, so yeah, I will upload this edit in maybe two more weeks right now it's Friday so I'll probably upload it the first week of March so yeah uh, hope you like the video guys and yeah peace